Weathers, looking at our tower cam time lapse in Fargo from today. We saw mainly clear skies during the morning with increasing clouds as we went through the afternoon. We were breezy at times with that southerly wind, getting temperatures up there with that sunshine as we were unseasonably warm today. We're at 67 degrees right now at Fargo, 61 at Grand Forks, 56 right now at Devil's Lake, and a 61 at Jamestown. Uh, near 60 degrees up toward the Canadian border in Minnesota and into Lakes Country. Temperatures range from 63 at Detroit Lakes to 68 at Fergus Falls. So the wind speeds look like this mainly between 10 and 20 miles per hour and it's from the south pumping in the warm air with higher gusts. Windiest conditions now out toward Bemidji and Wadena but nothing uh, absolutely terrible as uh, gusts gust were only to 21 miles per hour. We are seeing clear skies right now toward Lakes Country just south of the Bemidji area. Uh, elsewhere we are seeing mainly cloudy skies with a few passing sprinkles especially from Langdon to Devil's Lake and out toward the Grand Forks area. Most of this is not uh, reaching the ground, but you could see some sprinkles out there as you um, as this makes its way off to the east. High pressure is in charge of our forecast. It's uh, moving away, and as it does, it's pumping in that uh, flow from the uh, south, or that wind is really keeping us warm. Here's this low pressure system. We're definitely in the warm sector. We're tracking this warm front, or this cold front that is making its way through. It will move through as we go through the day on Saturday, but it will be mainly dry as we go through the overnight period. Temperatures will drop around daybreak into the lower 50s. We will keep partly to mostly cloudy skies across the area as we go through the afternoon as highs will again be where they were today, mainly into the mid to upper 60s. We'll clear out as we go through Saturday night as temperatures do fall back through the 50s and then eventually the 40s. But for the day on Saturday, planning your day, 53 at 7 a.m., mostly cloudy skies. It'll be very mild for that time of day and that time of year. 61 by around noon, partly cloudy skies. And as we make our way through 5 p.m., 67 again, partly cloudy skies. It will be unseasonably warm in Fargo. Also across the Southern Valley into the mid to upper 60s in most places, partly cloudy skies and mild by late afternoon, mostly cloudy into late Lakes country temperatures into the mid to upper 60s into Northland, Minnesota. They'll keep mostly cloudy skies with temperatures ranging from the upper 50s to lower 60s and upper 50s to lower 60s into the Northern Valley as they'll see partly cloudy skies and it will stay mild for this time of year. Now, as we go through the day on Sunday, we will start to cloud up with a chance of some showers, especially uh, out to our northern counties. Uh, temperatures uh, are going to stay warm as most of us will be into the mid to upper 60s, which is still above normal for this time of year. Here is the photo of the day. We call it Fall Colors, uh, taken at Maplewood Park, Minnesota. Thank you, Jay Yang, for this one. We're going to use it in the background of the seven-day forecast. And as we go through the day on Saturday, a high of 67, partly cloudy skies, mostly cloudy on Sunday, breezy, a high of 66 degrees. And then for Monday, a slight chance of some showers, still warm, 67. Then temperatures start to fall, 55 on Tuesday. Another chance of some showers, still breezy. 52 on Wednesday and Thursday, partly cloudy skies lasting through Friday as we will stay into the mid-50s. The weekend looks pretty good. Weekend is good. Uh, we're going to stay mainly dry and it will be warm for this time of year. All right. Thanks, Justin. Yeah. Honda is recalling thousands of its vehicles because of a parking brake issue. We've got the details for you up next.